Hey, what's up guys? Spencer Rhodes here. So, there has been some debates about the character of Henry in The Walking Dead, and he's been played by two different actors, and they're, they're both, they're, they're both the two brothers of Madison Lentz, who played Sophia in the first two seasons of The Walking Dead, but the, the older brother is currently playing Henry right now in season nine, and some people have been debating about whether or not he is a good actor, whether or not he's doing a good job, whether or not Henry is a character that should really stick around, or if he's just a shitty character, or if he's just an idiot. Is it the character that's shitty? Is it the actor that's shitty? Is the character good? Is the actor good? Is the actor doing a good job? One thing that's really not debatable is that since they killed off Carl, and, you know, Carl has a role in the comics that... Uh, that was cut short because he was killed off um, in the TV show in season 8 and if they followed the comics Carl would probably still be alive in like season 15 I mean he's still alive in the comics he's a huge character but since they killed off Carl in season 8 they gave some of Carl's comic storyline to Henry you know in the comics it, it's Carl that, that falls in love with Lydia it's 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 Carl that that uh, sneaks out of his community and goes after Lydia and you know it, it kind of starts the, the whole re, the, the, the whole beef between the Whispers and the Hilltop Alexandria Kingdom and that's what starts the the Heads on Spikes and that's what starts the Whisper of War and all that stuff and a lot of that comic material with Carl was given to Henry that's pretty much not debatable but, you know, some people are arguing about, you know, is Henry a good character? Is the actor good? Should he just be killed off? Is he just a waste of time? And I'll be honest, for the first few episodes of this actor as Henry, I wasn't really sure if I liked him or not. But in this past episode, he won me over. He won me over. I officially support this actor that's playing Henry, and I support Henry as a character. And I like I like the actor and I like the character. Um, the actor has he 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 has something that Chandler Riggs as Carl never had, which was which is subtlety. This, the actor that plays Henry is actually subtle. I don't know if everyone gets that, but but there was there was moments in in the last couple of episodes where the, the, there's a lot of like emotion in his voice and a, and a lot of conflicts and and and. You can tell, and it's very real and and sincere. And he doesn't overdo it. He doesn't underdo it. And I know his face is a little blank sometimes, but like you can see the emotions in his eyes, and 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 he yeah he doesn't make a lot of like ridiculous facial expressions. I mean he's not trying to act like well, William Shatner or, or something. He's not trying to like overdo it. I think he's doing a good job. I I think he's he's got subtlety, but. But I don't think he underdoes it. I don't think he overdoes it. I think, you know, he's playing this 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 hormonal seventeen year old. I mean, he is a hormonal seventeen year old in real life. I think he's like seventeen in real life, and um, I mean, I might be wrong about that. He might he might be like nineteen or something. I don't know. I think he's like his character's his character's age. I think he's like seventeen or something. But um, I think he's doing a good job. I I, I you know it's. it's he, he, you know, he's playing a teenager. You know, teenagers are shit. Let's be honest. Teenagers tend to be shit. You can't, you, you can't have a. I mean, you can, you can, but really, it's not realistic to have a teenage character that's, that's just like perfect and and does everything right. I mean, it, you are kind of a mess when you're a teenager. You know, and I think he's he's portraying Henry in that fashion, and it's realistic and. And I don't think he's emotionless. I don't think he's bland. I think he's he's subtle. Like there's just it's it's hard to ex explain, but I think there's a lot of subtlety in his voice and his eyes and the, the expressions that he makes. And you know him having to to make that hard difficult decision to 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 let Lydia go and and to to have Lydia be taken back with the whispers. That was just like his performance when he did that really broke my heart, and it, I found it to be very believable. And for some reason, there's a lot of people on the internet that are giving him shit, giving Henry shit, like, Oh, Henry's a little bitch. Oh, Henry's stupid. Like, uh, no, because he was getting to know this girl that had been abused and, and, and beaten and hit and, 
God knows what else and treated like an animal in, in a group of savages for the past eight years of her life that's that's known nothing but that. And in the brief few days that she had spent with Henry, she was starting to reach out and she was starting to, to seem like she wanted to rehabilitate and be, be a normal person. And then they're forced to send her back to the Whisperers. I understand why that's a difficult decision for Henry to make. I understand why he wants to resist and he wants to fight that. And so what if he's in love with her? I mean, do you remember being a teenager and being in love with a girl? What that was like? How crazy that made you? I completely understand Henry. Like, like he's that's a realistic teenager. Like, what are you attacking him for? Like, don't don't be a hypocrite. You know, um, it is what would happen. Carl did the same thing in the comics. You know, so I don't understand why there's so much hatred for him. You know, as a character, I think you know he's a he's a teenage boy. He's a teenage guy. And he's being a teenage guy, you know, and, you know, sending Lydia back to be abused, uh, you know, again, you know, possibly for the rest of her life, that is wrong. That That is a that is a difficult pill to swallow. And for him to, to not be able to live with it and, and to run off and try to rescue her, I do understand that. Yeah, it's stupid. It's brave, but it's stupid. Again, he's a teenager. He's in love with a girl. I mean, that's what happens. <laughs> What are you expecting? You know, so um, I, I like the character, and I, th I think the actor's doing a really good job. He, he's won me over. I think, I think he's subtle. He's got subtlety. You know, um, and he, I, don't know, I know some people are going to disagree with me, but it is what it is. That's just how I feel, and I, I'm a little bit worried about him getting killed off. I mean, I don't know. Like, we haven't had a death since Jesus. That was three episodes ago. Or, or, um, it'll be four episodes ago, um, this Sunday, in this Sunday's episode, and, um, you know, it, there's a scene where, where, like, Beta puts his hands on him, and, like, I'm worried that, you know, they, they want to, they, they, they want to give Beta a very good first impression, so they're gonna have Beta kill Henry or something, I don't know, they can't kill too many characters before the head's on spikes, though, so maybe Henry will make it, I hope Henry makes it, I like the character, He's got my vote, so yeah, I support Henry as a character, and I support the actor that plays him. Anyway, that's all I have for this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't be shy. Hit that like and subscribe. I'm not going anywhere. I make one to two Walking Dead videos per day, so please hit that subscribe button. Right now, we are at 376 subscribers. My goal is to try to get to 400 in the next few months. So just remember, every subscriber counts. Every bit of support matters and is very, very appreciated. We are getting closer and closer to 400 subscribers. Can't wait for that goal. Can't wait to get to that milestone. Anyway, with all that said, I am Spencer Rhodes, and I will see you guys later. Bye.